Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm doing like a big haul. I've got a massive boohoo parcel. I've got a couple things from Opole. I've got a really big, pretty little thing parcel. And then I've got some tracksuits from Pindy Doll. Pin, Pindy Doll? Pindy Doll? Like that. Um, yeah, I just wanted, I was just thinking like, I just always wear the same thing on rotation. Like, I haven't really bought anything for myself. Like in a long time and I thought I'm getting fed up with the stuff that I've got in my wardrobe so I want to do like a big kind of revamp of my wardrobe so yeah I'm just going to go through and like section so I like, do pretty little thing then boohoo then whatever in that order so you can see it um but yeah hope you enjoy so first up I'm going to do pretty little thing I think this whole pretty little thing order came to just under 200 pounds which for quite a lot of stuff I thought was pretty reasonable I got a couple things that were like more expensive but anyway I'll open this up so first up is this unitard I believe I'm gonna do like a try on I'm gonna do like unbox unbox it and then do like try on clips after so I'm just gonna quickly run through everything I got so it's this colour which I think is so cute like this unitard and then I got a matching one in charcoal for reference, I get most things in extra small slash UK4 slash UK6. I'll let you know which ones are getting which, but these two are extra small. So there's that one and then this colour. So that is the charcoal. They actually come with padding in them, which is quite nice. So yeah, hopefully they fit. Next up is, oh my God, I saw these jeans and they were four pound and I thought, literally can't say no. So, they're on sale um i think i got them in a i got them in a uk6 and they're just these like black jeans basically long legged mum jeans so if i don't like them it's not the end of the world um i can send them back but i thought i saw them for pound and thought i can't not try them because the jeans that i have from pretty little thing that i wear all the time that i think have been discontinued i got them in the sale for like seven pound and they're my all-time favorite jeans Oh, I then got some earrings, which I think are so cute. I'm trying to like wear different earrings because all I wear are my basic hoops, which also from Pretty Little Thing. But I thought maybe like try and go out there a bit. Well, not really out there, but these are the hoops. Can it focus? There we go. They're the hoops. I thought they're so cool. Like with a slick bun is exactly how I'm thinking to wear them. This is oh, a blazer. So I got two cropped blazers. Oh no, I think I got three blazers. Um, just because I thought to wear them with I mean it's kind of see through but I just thought to chuck on with just anything just like to make the outfit a bit nicer so I can try these so it's just a black one I got these in a UK 6 this is the cream one so it's just exactly the same crop blazer but in like a beige colour which I thought was so nice. I'm pretty sure these were like £10 as well which I mean can't go wrong. Next up is a pair of jeans. I mean I thought I had enough pairs of jeans maybe even too many but I saw these and thought they were really cool so I thought I should try. Oh they stink a bit. They smell like chlorine. I was just about to say can you smell that? Yeah. So I got these in a UK 6 because they're meant to be like oversized and I've got these button things if they are too big then I can just, well they look huge um that I can just like make them smaller but they're these like baggy jeans oh gosh they look massive I feel like I'm not gonna like these but they've got these slits on the side like on the thigh and it's an asymmetric hem here which I think is so flattering so yeah and the colours are really nice they're really long and big maybe these won't be a hit anyway next I was about to say next up, but they've just given me a tampon kit, so thanks, pretty little thing. Can't go wrong with that. I was gonna say I didn't order that. Right, so then I got a faux leather blazer because I thought I wear so many just all black outfits and it's just a bit boring. So I thought with like a faux leather blazer, ooh, this is really bad quality. Oh god, it stinks of fish. <sighs> like I bet you can't even iron this, can you? Um, but I thought this would like 
an all black outfit or not an all black outfit but it would look quite cool so I can try it I don't want to put that on my bed gross I have no idea what this is oh wait oh my god yeah so I got this jacket which I think now thinking about it, I think it's spoiler this is probably gonna stink as well okay this is fine but this is so cute I'm sorry this was very pricey for pretty little thing I must say I think this was like 50 pounds um but it's this like cropped jacket it looks a lot more blue on camera than it does in real life does it mm, maybe not but I thought that is just so nice like just over like a basic outfit just because I'm a basic girl but so cute actually I was just gonna say I will leave all the product codes in the description below or on the screen when I try them on whatever so I'll make sure that you can see everything that I've got right then I got this top and fully expecting this to be see-through um because let's be real it's a pretty little thing and it's white no hate pretty little thing but but I just thought oh gosh it's really see-through this is going straight back but the idea was that it goes like this over your chest and then the back is just like completely open i thought this was so nice they did this in a few different colors so i might see if black looks nice but i did want like less black clothes because we all know my problem with black clothes i saw this and like i feel like you always have to look on the sales and pretty little thing i get some of the best things on the sales because it's stuff that i wouldn't have like searched for um but i got this and it's like this like oatmeal kind of color uh bralette 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 but I thought that was so cute. Like, even just with, like, shorts or just, like, with joggers. It's quite small, though. I don't know if that's going to fit over my boobs. Um, but it's really, it's really like, soft material. And it, this was, like, pretty sure this was £4 in the sale. So. Oh, my gosh, I forgot I got this. So, this is, like, a matching set. God, I ordered a lot more than I thought I did. A matching set for, like, gym kind of vibe. It's a lot greener than I was expecting in real life. It's these shorts with a matching top. Um, here, I got this kind of top, but I don't normally wear this kind of neckline. It's like what you see in set. So I don't know whether it's going to be very flattering on me. But the girl in the picture, I always get sucked in by the models. They always look so good, and I'm like, oh, I could pull that off. Oh, no. I hate that neckline. I'm not wearing this. I don't think that's what I ordered. Racer crop top. I mean, it didn't look like this on the model. It was like a low, it was like almost like it would be down there. Hmm. Not a fan. Well, we'll try on and see. And then last but not least, I believe. Yeah, last but not least, I got this. I don't know what possessed me to get this, if I'm completely honest. Um, but I thought it was quite cute. It's like an angel number necklace the only thing is it like right. oh gosh the 777 is really big what does it look like anyway that is all my pretty little thing stuff so i'll include the try on bit now this is the first thing it's like the unitard from pretty little thing i really like it it's really comfy it's like i'm not really fake tanned at the minute i've got a bit on but like not enough so that might be why i'm looking like a bit washed out and like the background's not really helping but i think this is really nice it fits like it's it's tight but it's not like suffocating me tight if that makes sense um i did try these on without the blazers but they don't really go but i'll just show you them for the try on so the first blazer like they're very lightweight blazers like they're kind of rubbish quality but that's all I kind of really want them for is just like to, I mean, I guess it's kind of close with like black and white trainers maybe. Um, but this is the blazer. It's, I think I got a size four or a UK six. So I'll, so I'll, I'll put it here, what I got. But this is just the black one. I really like the size, like the length. I'm a fan of these. This blazer as well, which kind of is like a very 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 similar colour to what the unitard is but I like this I mean they both need a good iron but this is what this one looks like 
they're not the comfiest like they're not the most soft material but for 10 pounds that's what i was expecting so i love this color as well it's like a nice neutral would go with anything kind of color so i like this a lot and then we've got the jacket thing which i really like as well like the color i think is such a lovely color like this just like a nice thing like to chuck on over like any outfit really that would go and then the back's just like that yeah i like this cute this is the other unitard it's like this charcoal-y color i really like it it's really nice it's again like the same i mean it's the exact same size so it's the same kind of feel it's got like padding in which is like nice i guess i put the color is a bit odd like i don't know why i don't know does it make me look like a weirdo i don't think i'd wear these like by themselves i'd always wear them with something over it as like an outfit rather than just like a plain thing because i feel like i'm gonna like dive into a pool and like compete swimming or like go on a bike with these on or like wrestle someone so i think i need something to make it more of an outfit rather than like a sports suit you know i'm pleasantly surprised by the t-shirt it's not quite as see-through as i was expecting it to be the back is so cute like so cute i'm literally obsessed but it just doesn't fit properly like i feel like it doesn't so i'm going to send this back i don't know if i like the one shoulder on me either um also the jeans are an absolute no, I'm sorry. Like these are so big. Like they're called boyfriend jeans and I get why. Like it literally looks like I've put on somebody else's jeans that don't fit. Like the idea is there. Like maybe I should have got a UK for and I might have been fine. But yeah, this is a no. I mean, I don't know if you can see how long these are. Yeah, these are a no. I have to like keep holding this down because this is just gonna ride up. This is tiny. Um, and I don't like the jeans either. They're like, when I think about it, it's like, I have jeans that I, those black jeans I was talking about earlier, they're my favorite pair of black jeans. Like I'd never pick these over them. So it's silly to keep them just because they're cheap. Sorry, I'm trying to like protect myself here. <laughs> um, yeah. These are both going back, unfortunately. Okay, so this is definitely not the top that I ordered. The top I ordered was like here. Like I was definitely right. And I do love the colour. It's a lovely like um material. Like, can you see this looks weird? Um like it's just a lovely material, but can I see myself choosing this and wearing it out? No. Like I just don't, I wouldn't leave the house in this clothing. So I do really like it, but it, it would be silly of me to keep it because I'm, I just won't wear it. I don't think. I'm being sensible. Um, and then this is just the faux leather. Not that I'd wear these together, but this is just the faux leather jacket, like blazer thing. I actually surprisingly like this. Like, the material is really bad. Like, I'm going to see if I, need, if, I, if I can't iron it, I'm not going to keep it, I don't think because it needs a good iron and it stinks, it needs to go through the wash, but I do like it and I feel like for a nice, even if it's like, like I just think it look cool with like an all black outfit, not obviously with this, let's ignore what's going on underneath. So yeah, I'm gonna keep this, I think. Okay, so it's time for the Buku section. I did get a birthday present for my sister. Do you remember like, if you watched my old video of when I bought my sister the tracksuits, her birthday was the 26th of May. And I've just got around to buying her the second tracksuit. In, in my defence, they kept going out of stock and stuff. But one of these tractors is for her. But I will show you what it looks like. Um, right, let me open this. This is just going to be like a lucky dip for me getting this stuff out. Oh, I think this is for my sister. Right, this is for Tash. Um, but I'll show you anyway because it's a really nice tracksuit. <laughs> so it's this like sea green, I think it's called. Sea green sage green sorry this hoodie which says like wardrobe essentials on it and then here is the tracksuit i don't know whether this was the one that i bought for tash i don't think it was but i bought one last like in a video before if you haven't watched it um that was a weird color but i really like this color oh my god and this was 15 pounds i believe 
with the whole tracksuit thing. So it's these joggers and then the matching jumper. The only thing is, I feel like the jumpers are sometimes quite small. I don't know if that's a nice size. And my favorite thing about this jumper, no loop hole things. That is my pet peeve of jumpers for me. I think it makes it look cheap. I'm not gonna lie, like I love a jumper that doesn't have it. I feel like it just makes it look expensive, makes it look so nice. So I love this. It's got a stain on it. And it was 15 pounds, so I can't complain. But oh, this is my new favorite tracksuit. So excited. Oh my god, I've got so many tracksuits in this order. It's literally July. This is oh this bando top, like one of those kind of Zara dupes, I believe. Um you'll see what I mean. It's like this. I mean it looks like absolutely nothing here. And then it's got like the slits by the side, like so it's just a bit more interesting than just like a plain bando black top. Then next up, I did get another black top. I don't know if any of you follow me on TikTok, um, but I always post in this H&M top, and every time I post in it, everyone's always like, where's the top from, where's the top from? It's always out of stock, but it's from H&M, and I, I now can't get my hands on the black one. So I thought this is a very good, kind of same vibe, maybe even nicer, to be honest. So if anyone wonders on my H&M top, it, where that top is from, it's from H&M, but this is from Miss Pap. I don't know, Miss Pap was sold on boohoo um but it's lovely i really like that well it looks like it's gonna be nice i then got these um shorts which i thought were like stone color but they're a bit like yellowy well they look yellow in person they look a really nice color on that like, camera i got these in a uk eight because the girl in the picture said she was wearing a 10 and i was like you look tiny and she's wearing a 10 so I thought right I'll just go for an 8 because it's still two sizes above what I normally go for and I wanted them a bit lower waisted I didn't want them high waisted so I thought I could just size up and maybe just have to like cut this bit if it's a bit long but I don't know what I can think about the colour then got this shirt which I'm thinking of just wearing with like blue jeans because it's like a little cropped shirt <laughs> this might just look like I look like I should be in Greece or something but I thought this was so cute, like a nice day out in summer. I mean, it's a lot more blue than I was expecting, but it's like cropped, just cute. I like it, but I might not like it on. I've got this top. Oh, this is another one of the like H&M tops I'm talking about, but it's not H&M, but it's white. And obviously we never know what white products are gonna be like, especially when they're cheap. Ooh, I do not like that neckline. Why does it go so high up? We can always try. It's fine, we can try. And last but not least, from Boohoo, I got these earrings. So <laughs> these were quite cool. I was trying to go for the cool earring while still staying in my comfort zone vibe. They're like this. I think they're so nice. Like a nice hoop with a slick bun. So that is all of the Boohoo stuff. So I'll show you the trial now. I love the colour of this tracksuit, but is it just me or is this like really small? Like I know I like my stuff oversized, but does this not look too small for me? Like I feel like the joggers are like fitted, like tight joggers. I don't know, I need your opinion on this. Like I like it and I love the colour, like I mean if I send this back I will get it in the medium because I really like this. But I just like, I feel like the jump is the right size. The joggers, they're just throwing me, like, I don't know. I think I'm gonna keep it, because I love the jumper anyway, so it's like, for the joke, like, it was 15 pounds, so I'd pay 15 pounds on the jumper, I can just give the joggers to somebody else if I don't want them. But, love this. I just tried on this top, and let's just say I could not put it on the internet, because it was so see-through. Actually, with saying that though, I didn't try it on with a strapless bra. I'm gonna try this on with a strapless bra, and show you again but on the other hand this is the best thing I've got from this haul so far this top I'm sorry I'm gonna go and purchase it in the other colors before I post this video just so I can get my hands on it but the neckline for me is everything I have tied this at the back but that is the same with every top that I wear that looks like this but this is so nice I love it so much the neckline is perfect for me it's so beautiful um go and get this i love it the shorts on the other hand are huge like they're not the 
oversized cool look that I was after they 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 look too big so these are going back I might order them in a smaller size I was just I was put off by the fact that they said that the model was wearing a UK 10 um because they look tight on her like they look like this on her so I was like right I'll get an eight and they should be baggy but they're just massive I've just thrown on my super dry shorts that this was the kind of look I was going for for the for the like et crew, yeah, it's kind of no stone, whatever, the stone ones, but they just didn't put off. But this is the top that's like bandeau and split at the side. I'm iffy on this. I don't know whether it looks right on me. I don't know, I feel like maybe don't wear it with these kind of shorts. I don't know. I'm not entirely sure. I need your help on this one as well. I feel like I like it, like when I'm looking in the viewfinder I think it looks nice, I like the side bit I think it looks really nice and the quality is great, like the quality is like thick, like it, it's nice, so don't really know, I feel like maybe you need something skinnier, like a skinnier jean slash short with this but let me know what you think okay I can't work out if this is giving I'm a sailor slash I work at Waitrose slash don't really know but I, oh, I do like it like even if it's just to go over a bikini like if it doesn't ever make it to like a proper outfit like to go over a white bikini I think it's cute but I really like this I think it's cool you're probably looking at me and thinking did not take that off right now but I think it's cool I'm gonna keep this I think even with like blue shorts blue jeans white bag like it's giving the vibe that I wanted it to give like it's what I expected of it so I'm happy with this I hope you're happy with this too okay I take it back it's definitely wearable I've got like an actual bra on rather than a strapless bra because I can't find my strapless bra what just came out of my mouth um I do like it but I think I'm just gonna get the Miss Pap one the black one in white just because the neckline isn't quite perfect and I just think I'd, I'm not in desperate need of it and I, I would rather get something that I love than something that I like. So I'm going to send it back, I'm just holding it because I don't want to tie it because I'm not going to keep it. Um, but it looks like this if you if you don't tie it or like do anything. So yeah, like it is pretty, like I do like it but for me I prefer the neckline to be a bit wider. We are on to Opoly now, so they had their three for 45 sale and I thought, I saw a top that, I saw two tops that I liked and I thought, well, they come to over £45 so I might as well get another one and make it cheaper. So then I picked like another one, um, but their sales, Opoly three for 45 sales are so good, like it's literally stuff, I think one of the tops was like £30 and it's like, you literally get it for half price because it's like three divided for 45 divided by three is always 15 um, so I got three things. This packaging is so rattly, so I can't speak while I'm moving. I got a bodysuit, which is this. Because I don't know if um, I said on here, but I bought a bodysuit from Skims because I had the, the black bodysuit. And then I bought like the white top that kind of was like the matching kind of thing. And it was so see-through and it was like 55 pounds or something ridiculous and it was see-through and I thought no chance and this gave me the same vibes as the Skims body suit that was from iPoly and it's a really lovely colour um rude so I got this I think I might have got this in a size 4 and iPoly sizing is always so tight but I mean it's really good quality yeah I got this in the UK 4 so I'll try this on with like shorts or something then next up this is the other thing that I like loved when I first saw it it's this really really nice what well, i think it's really nice bodysuit i don't know if you can see the detailing um ignore my two missing fingers it's like this um under like the boob area which i think is just so nice i got this in a uk6 because sometimes in opoly like the boob section is so small I'm not saying that i've got big boobs but they just don't fit and then i can't wear it so hopefully this fits and it's like i feel like it might be more comfortable because it's uk6 anyway then last but not least I got this like knitted kind of top I think anyway oh it's like a funny texture why is it rattling oh I didn't know there was all oh, right okay you can take it off so you can either wear it like this 
or you can wear it without the like sleeve things, not sleeves, what are they called? Straps. So it's like a fold over bandeau top. I think that's so nice. It's tiny, but that's fine. <laughs> it's so it's such like a cute colour, I think, even just with like black shorts or like a joggers or anything like that. So nice, it just like folds over there and at the back as well. So yeah, I'm really pleased with those. They all look really nice, I hope they fit. I love this bodysuit. I mean, it's black, so it's already got like starting with like five points, but I love it so much. Like just under shorts even, I just think it looks so nice. The like material here bit is so pretty. Like the neckline's so flattering. I love it, it's really comfy as well. I mean, it's even comfy with like the hygiene protectors and stuff in it. So, you know when you can like not really even feel the bodysuits there, that's what it gives. And it's just lovely, I love this. And like the straps are adjust adjustable, so if you've got a longer shoulder bit here, or shorter, you can just adjust it like strap wise for what you want. So yeah, massive thumbs up for this. This is another big thumbs up from me. I think this is so nice, like the fit of it, especially. I don't know, I just really like this. The material is really good quality. If you can see, like, so nice. And the buck, it's the exact same. Oh my God, I almost fell over my bed. But yeah, love this as well. This, I got this in extra small and I got this, the one before in a UK six. Yeah, UK6. This is another 10 out of 10 for me from O Poly. I don't need a bra on, like I put a bra on. I think you can kind of see it, like the outline. But if I was to wear a bra, it would definitely be a seamless one because it is so tight. It's like, you can see the bra, but it's not see-through at all, if that makes sense. I can't actually do it up because I'm alone and my arm doesn't do that. <laughs> but love this. The neckline, I think it's really flattering. Like I just like the skims kind of, it's giving me skims. Um, very thick that's the only thing like, i don't even know if i'll be able to wear this in summer i feel like i'm sweating as we speak i'm not but like almost there. i'm just dramatic um but love this the color i think so flattering everything love it oh poly and this final package is from pindy doll and this was actually gifted to me not for this video but just like pr gifted stuff so and I've had some of their joggers before and they're so comfy and so I've got some tracksuits which I'm really excited for. So I got, first of all, this sage, what, this sage colour which is so nice. I feel like for airport fits these would be so good. So these are the joggers, I think I got these in a size 6. Yeah, so size 6, it's such like a nice pale sage colour I love and then the jumper I think I've got in a size 8 so that you could mix and match the sizes which I love with a tracksuit oh no it was in 10 I don't know if I meant to get that in a size 10 oh well it's quite big that might be a very oversized tracksuit that's fine and then I got this pale pink colour, which I think is so pretty. Like, I never wear stuff that's pink. And this girl, if, you, if you're watching this video, there's a girl on my TikTok that keeps telling me to wear pink. And I was like, I've got a pink tracksuit coming. So, this is for you. Um, so, this is the colour. It reminds me of, like, my old ballet days. Did I get this in a UK 10 as well? No, I got this in an 8. Maybe I just messed up on the sizes for that one. So, this little pale pink colour. So nice. And then the tracksuit bottoms would just be the same as the others like they're all the same tracksuit just in different colors so you've got these bottoms i just feel like that's such like a girly because it's like barbie season as well like cute i then got another pink one which is like a different like a purpley kind of pink which is also so nice it's actually kind of like bubble gummy is that the right word i think i got these in a bigger size because i wanted like one that was like going to be like my slouchy oversized like um tracksuit so I got the top in a 10 and this one maybe I just meant in accidentally click the other one for a 10 um this one and then the joggers I think I got them in an 8 just so they're like as comfy as possible so they are the joggers love thank you very much
for those. I absolutely love this. I think the colour is so cute. Like, such a pretty, like pretty is the exact word to describe it. Like colour, the fit is really nice. Like, oversized, the right amount. Joggers, good size, thumbs up. This is another love. Like, the colour of this, I think I prefer this colour just because I'm not like a pink girl trying to move more into like pastels but this colour is like if I had to wear a pastel I would always choose this and I think this is so beautiful this colour like you need this. This is the final tracksuit and it's like more of a purpley colour on I don't know I feel like it's changed colour when I put it on but it is so nice this is the 10 with the size 8 joggers and it's like the perfect slouchy fit like I love so much this is so beautiful love it so much I think this stage is definitely still my favorite but I'm obsessed with all these tracksuits right okay I'm gonna try them on that is everything I got that is a ridiculous amount of clothing actually wait let me just add in I got some holiday clothes that I've not like shown but I'll show them now one sec these are all from Pretty Little Thing, I believe. Oh, that's not meant to be in there. So first up, I got this dress, which is so out there for me. Like, how different is this to what I normally wear? But I thought, cute holiday outfit. So it's like this all the way to the floor and it ties at the back. It's got like a cow back. Is that the right word? Like, does that at the back. Really cute. Then I got this lemon set, which is like crochet. It's a bit see-through, so I'm gonna have to get some like nude shorts or like just wear nude like a nude thong or something. So it's like this kind of stops mid mid calf, maybe just below the knee vibe, and it's like so flattering. These bits kind of go up further, so it gives you like that nice kind of silhouette. Is that the right word? I don't know. And that comes with the matching like bandeau. Bando, 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 top, so it's like this. And this, although it's like crochet, like it's not see-through at all, it's really nice. And then, last but not least, I got this outfit, which the top is slightly see-through. You do need to wear like nipple covers or something because I think it is like a beach outfit, but I thought I'd wear it for the evening. So the front like ties, <laughs> that's really badly shown. The front kind of ties, no, not ties, like twists like that. Then these bits go down your arms. Then there's a matching skirt, which is floor length. And this kind of goes around your waist as well. So yeah, love. I cannot believe how many clothes I have scattered around my room. And that is absolutely everything that I bought. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want any product codes, I'm gonna put them in the description. I'll put my sizes and everything that I got for reference so you can see if you want to get anything. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in my next one. Love you.